Hey, welcome to Learn About Astronomy and this is a quick video for news. We are uh, January 23 and uh, Thursday, January 23 and uh, 2014 and we've discovered actually this week is a little event happening in the sky, a supernova. We don't see those very often and it's uh, actually quite bright, comes from the supernova and M82. And this is what you see here, the picture that we see here is taken from the University of Calgary's Rodney Astronomical uh, Observatory in Alberta, Canada and that the two lines show you a bright star and this is a supernova that uh, is an N82, the cigar, it's um, called it the cigar galaxy or the cigar uh, shaped galaxy. Uh, it's uh, quite bright, it shines at around magnitude 11, um, it does require a telescope of at least um, 8 inch diameter to uh, see but um, if you have a dark sky, 8 inch or more telescope will bring you this. But it's to watch because we've just seen it only a few days ago. And if it follows supernovas that we've seen in the past, in the next week or two, it should brighten more. So it can become easy to see even in uh, modest telescopes or even binoculars. So let's you know keep an eye on that and I'll actually have updates of this galaxy. So M82 is the galaxy where you can see this and uh, for those asking what's a supernova? A supernova is basically a star that exploded and um, usually stars that have at least uh, I believe it's five or six times the mass of the Sun ends their life in supernova format and they explode and spew all of their material through space. And this is an event that is an incredible event in energy. It sends so much energy into space into, with light, heat, x-rays that it's easy to detect. Uh, M82 is a galaxy that's in terms of the universe close to us, it's 11 million light years away. So, um, technically that's quite close uh, for a galaxy, of course. It's one of our neighbors in the universe. If you want to take a look, maybe you have a telescope or want to maybe try and spot the galaxy in dark sites, the galaxy itself can be spotted uh, with a small telescope and you can try for that um, little supernova there that you can see on one of the edges. If we take a look at a map here, you see the Big Dipper on the right side of the screen or Ursa Major, you'll notice that M82 is right there close to that. So this is pretty much where you'll have uh, the Big Dipper coming through and uh, let's make it a little bigger here so um, this is where you're gonna get M82 um, in the sky so you'll have to uh, spot the Big Dipper and basically if you take a diagonal of the two stars in the uh, the ball here let's look here to the ball we have pretty much a straight line into M82 and so um, it's 11 million light years away and um, basically it is close to another um, galaxy M81. So um, it, um, the supernova was first observed on 21 January 2014, so that's two days ago. And uh, we never know how bright it's going to get. So uh, why not just take a peek in case it becomes bright enough for a small telescope or uh, in an objects. And it is rated at um, 10.9. So it's when it was discovered, 
It was discovered at a the supernova I'm talking about. It was discovered at 11.7 magnitude. It has brightened to 10.9 as of January 23. That's today. So it's brightening. So who knows what we can see. So M82, a supernova. And uh, just quick note here to think about this. Imagine that that supernova is in a galaxy 11 million light years. It means that what we're seeing now happened 11 million years ago. So that's a long, long time. None of us were here, and uh, even the human race was kind of starting. So uh, 11 million years ago, this happened. And that's what we're seeing today. And uh, there's no danger of anything. So if you see hoaxes on the internet, because I'm sure you're going to see some, uh, no, there's no danger, especially it's so far away that it can't be any effect uh, on Earth um, for this uh, supernova explosion and the galaxy M82. Hope you enjoy the videos and that uh, they keep you informed. If you do, please uh, subscribe to our channel. You'll be informed when new videos are online. And if you have any comments or questions or maybe you have a suggestion, let us know. And hope you stay in touch on Learn About Astronomy. Bye-bye.